As we come to air tonight, lifeguards across the coastal bend and particularly in Port Aransas are watching the waters closely. Watching everything from churning waves to rip currents to things that could turn a holiday weekend outing into tragedy if you aren't being careful. Our Michael Gibson has more in our top story at five. Port Aransas lifeguard Ford Blaylock is always prepared to try and save the day. And with the dangers lurking in the Gulf waters over this 4th of July weekend, he may end up having to save a life or two. You get find yourself caught in a rip current, find yourself being pulled away from shore. Um, your number one choice is to start swimming parallel to the shore. Start swimming any way, you know, north or south. Just make sure you're not swimming against it. Jackson Robley is the Port Aransas surf rescue manager, and he and Ford Blaylock are going to be watching the waters closely because of the threat of rip currents and the intensity of the wave action caused by a Gulf storm. While they say even an experienced swimmer can run into trouble out here, they definitely make sure and watch for the children who get anywhere near the water. Really talk to your kids about the safety of the water. If we have a red flag flying, make sure your kids really aren't going past where they can stand. It's very quick um, that especially some of our smaller children out here can get picked up by a wave and pulled out, and that doesn't even need to be a rip current to pull them out. Porter Rensis Police Chief Scott Burroughs was watching a crew finishing its demolition of the old police department building. That just before the Port A beaches became completely packed. He says once he and his officers have to hit the beach on patrol, one of the number one calls happens to be for missing children. Children getting away from their parents is, is a big issue for us. It's a real drain on our resources because everybody responds. So we have, it pulls all the lifeguards, it pulls all the police officers, it pulls any fire off, firefighters that are on duty to help go find those kids. The chief is asking parents out there to please keep an eye on their children and make sure you know where they're at every second of the time you're out here along the beach. That's because in a blink of an eye, a perfect day at the beach can turn into a deadly nightmare. Michael Gibson, 3 News.